Um, welcome to the most low quality vlog I've ever done in my life. No need to set a timer today to do like a 10 minute timed vloot or anything like that because the sun is gonna tell us when to quit because I think we have like 10 uh, give or take minutes of sunshine left. And let me tell you guys, this peach, this peach, look at how dirty it is from all my fingerprints. I seriously need to sanitize it somehow, but oh my gosh, I got this as I was preparing to get things for an upcoming video. It's going to be a hurl of sorts and in the hurl items was this peach and it's so squishy. I wish you could poke it. Anyway, if you follow me on Snapchat, then you probably already know the precursor or you are part of the reason why I am doing this vloot today because I asked you guys if I should just do like a catch em up vloot uh, explaining my, what is it now, four, five day absence. I was complaining on Snapchat that I definitely do think that this is one of the longest breaks that I have ever taken from YouTube. And to make an incredibly long story short, my mom ended up having to have a surgery yesterday. She had a hernia and it was like, it's like one of those things that's like a big deal and not a big deal. You know, anytime anybody has to go in for surgery, especially me, like I am a person, like my anxiety is like whoo, triggered through, through the moon about medical things and people I love having medical things done. So uh, basically like over the weekend, this is how much of a child I am, okay? Uh, she was like, planning on telling me like right before she went to go have the surgery so that I wouldn't spend the last like two months of my life just like panicking thinking about when it was like upcoming um so I had asked you guys the question in Friday's video um what video you wanted to see over the weekend if you wanted to does this thing really work or a world's weirdest and then I found out that my mom was having this surgery on Monday morning and then I just fell to pieces uh panicking and it's just it's it's honestly stupid so I have literally just been watching a lot of movies with Dogman over the weekend just kind of like relaxing and trying to just not drive myself totally crazy and then of course you know once my mom had the procedure yesterday and got home I've just been helping her and helping my dad to help her you know cooking food and going to the grocery store and you know just doing a bunch of things so I have not been able to like sit down and put makeup on and record anything for YouTube or do any editing in many 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 days and I don't know I just feel like I've been having like some crazy setbacks recently because I feel like I feel like this has definitely been like the longest break in a long time that I've taken off of YouTube, but I feel like it was a couple weeks ago I was also like explaining where I had been. Why am I getting a software update question right now? Jeez, a woo! Technology. Oh my gosh, dude. Mosquitoes, mosquitoes. Mosquitoes are out of control right now. I don't know what the ecological downfall would be if we killed all the mosquitoes, but I am willing to take that risk. I got like two bites like on my forehead. The swelling at least is going down a little bit now. Uh, and I got a bite on my arm earlier today and they are just swarming right now. I do not know why the city is not spraying. They don't love us enough. Definitely mosquitoes are out of hand and I wish that we didn't have them. Uh, so the other thing that I've just been doing for the past many days, four days, is I've been crocheting a blanket for my mom. That's something I do when I'm like just freaking out, panicking, is I try and do something crafty with my hands, like crocheting or needlework, something like that, you know? And I was thinking like that old saying, I don't even know if anybody hears this anymore where it's like, idle hands are the work of the devil. So you're supposed to just like do some sort of handiwork or something and then you're gonna like, it's it's all gonna be better for you. That's the old adage. I'm not sure how much that works, but ugh! oh my gosh. I thought I was getting bitten again, but I'm just now itching from the bite that I just got. Nobody wants to know, nobody wants to know. But look at this. I have been, that's how far along on this blanket I am already and it's so fluffy and my mom loves the color blue so I have been making a blue blankie 
And I wanted to try and have it done by the time she was done with her procedure, but I literally crocheted until I thought my hand was going to fall off. Like this hand was so swollen yesterday, I could barely like hold on to the steering wheel to drive. So that's when you know you've taken it too far. Good news is my Starbucks is back. So at least now I have liquid refreshment and I don't feel like I am sincerely low on caffeine or anything anymore so I can do a proper sippy sippy today other thing that I've become addicted to that I really wanted to put in my August favorites all month I have been so addicted to YouTube like creepy stories on YouTube I didn't even know this was a thing it like randomly suggested a video I told you guys like last month or whenever I did my last monthly favorites about how we love watching all Carl Pilkington related things so I don't know why YouTube suggested these types of videos like in conjunction with that but I'm glad that they did it's like I don't know if you guys have ever heard of the channel Mr. Nightmare or Be Busta is a good one Haley told me about that channel and also um Southern Cannibal I have been liking his narration voice as well but some of these stories are really 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 creepy so if you take my advice like just be warned like I think some of them are nightmare inducing I literally watch them and for some reason it just like sort of lulls me to sleep I don't know why that's the most calming thing to me is to like literally just listen to someone talking and even though they might be talking about like I don't know horrifying things like if you just talk to me I'll fall asleep. That sounds like the worst thing ever. But they do stories on like the five creepiest things ever found in people's basements or like, you know, 10 true Craigslist horror stories. It is engrossing. And when all my friends came down to visit, uh, Kat came down to visit and Haley stayed for a couple days as well, I was like, you guys, all we're gonna do is listen to these stories. <laughs> or like anytime we were just like sitting at home eating or doing whatever we do, I was putting on these stories. They are so addicted, addictive. And if you love like creepy stuff, you're gonna love it. I will have to double check, but I do think that does this thing really worked? Does this thing really worked? That's not a video. Uh, but I do think that does this thing really work? One over world's weirdest in the poll. And you guys, I seriously thought world's weirdest was going to win. Because I had already started like filming things in advance for the new world's weirdest video. And then everybody ended up voting for does this thing really work? And now I'm like, oh my god, I've got to... I've got to pick an item for that too. Hopefully this week or this weekend we will have like just a double decker because it was so weird in the poll. I think uh, does this thing really work? Clearly one. But then in um, most of the comments people were commenting their opinion like which one we should do. And I think most of the votes were for world's weirdest. It's so crazy. So it's like anybody that actually voted picked does this thing really work? And anybody that was like commenting was saying world's weirdest. So I'm just like what? What do I do? I don't know. I do have like a lot of fun stuff coming up. I've got some hauls in the works and by in the works I mean they're in my mind. And I have a pinter test coming up and I have and I forgot I just did a face mask thing for First Impression Friday last Friday because so many of you guys have been asking me to do it. So I ordered it um, of one of those new magnetic masks. I feel like there are so many new face mask products out there right now. Like my, uh, my does this thing really work is also a face mask related thing so I'm like wait this can't just become the face mask channel wow that light just went out I'm at that old creepy school that I used to hang out all the time at let me know if you guys want me to do the magnetic mask testing out this week I don't even have to do it on Friday I could just do it on Wednesday or something and we can just test out the magnetic mud or if you guys feel like I've done too much face maskery lately because I know once again, last week we had an object as well, too. But I'm pretty excited uh, for the next World's Weirdest that is going to come up because it's all World's Weirdest, like, back-to-school supplies. Like, just the weirdest school supplies that I was ever, ever able to find. I need to go back to school. And before all this stuff went down, I tested out one of the items that I got because, like, some of these are, like, I, I actually had to go somewhere to test them out. And let me tell you guys it was 
the messiest, craziest. Oh my God. I went to uh, my friend. He's actually like a real live teacher. And I was like, hey, can I come test this out in your classroom? And like literally it was like mess everywhere. I felt so guilty. I'm like, I'm sorry I brought this on your life just be ready for that one hopefully i will have that done by this weekend i still have many many objects i kind of went crazy i this is definitely this world's weirdest is going to be the most weird products we have ever tested out in one video i think that there's like there's definitely more than 10. I don't know what I was thinking. I was just like, oh yeah, I'll order that. Oh yeah, I'll order that. <laughs> Why not 50 in one video? Uh, so, wow, that's not bouncy. Can you guys, it's, it's sort of, okay, no, nothing's happening. I'm definitely sorry for being gone for so long. I just know that you guys are probably wanting to come home and have some swamp family time. So I'm going to try and like, get it together and get back in the routine of things but I think the sun is telling us that this video is over also you guys I'm gonna try I'm gonna try so hard this year to do vlogoween I'm gonna try and get it together and at least have like some fun video every day even if it's like a little video even if it's like a little video I feel like I have the hiccups I feel like I'm trying to get the hiccups but it's like I just can't hick. Also, you guys, there is this pair of shoes. I want them so bad. I want them so bad, so bad. Uh, and I found them on Doll's Kill, and I will insert a picture of them now. I want to order them so bad. They are so amazing looking. I just don't know if I'd wear them all the time. I'm, like, trying to make up excuses in my mind for when and where I could wear these shoes all the time. They are amazing looking. They're not practical that much or maybe they are practical for some people I don't know uh I don't know why I'm randomly going on this shoe tangent um you know what I've been watching too many of those creepy stories now though because anytime I'm in a slightly isolated area and somebody pulls up behind me I'm like oh my god they're here to kill me so maybe don't watch as many of those stories as I have been but I will link those channels in the info box for you guys do you guys see that mosquito just looming in the back it's trying to find a good opportunity to bite me anyway i'm gonna go now if not i'm just gonna keep jumping from one tangent to the next so i love you guys so so much and let's hope that i will have a normal sort of video up tomorrow with normal not subpar quality so i love you guys so so much and stay sassy and i will see you guys tomorrow i love y'all bye oh my god you guys is everything is everything I just filmed is the audio jacked? I got a new phone case. It looks really amazing, but I think maybe it covers where the sound is. And now I'm panicking. I don't know what to do. I'm just gonna op op I'm gonna upload it. And if you guys tell me it's terrible, I will take this phone case off and I will throw it away. I kind of can't tell. I was just listening to it and I can't. I can't. I can't. I can't tell. Dude, there's like just a truck sound. Oh my god. Dude, I hope these people aren't here to kill me. This, like, same silver truck, it's just been loitering. They just, like, parked over there. Of course, what am I doing? I'm also, I'm now suspicious of somebody whose activity is the exact same activity that I'm doing. Maybe they're another vlogger. <laughs> hey there, fellow YouTubers. Now I just waved at a, at a truck. Just a random truck that I don't know. I'm just waving. What is wrong with me? What is seriously wrong with me? They've just been idling over there. It's it's honestly kind of creepy. I need to stop. Just let me know. Is the audio bad? Here's another minute. Here's another minute of me rambling. Ain't nobody got time for this. Dude, that truck is now idling at the front of this. Cool. I'm going to get out of here. I hope I see you guys tomorrow. Cliffhanger. Um, I should probably, I should, I should probably be more creeped out by this. Bye.